Hello, hello, and happy Friday. Happy Valentine's Day, you guys. I love you guys so much. Thank you for coming back and back and back again to watch my journey. So normally I just, you know, cook on Friday, but it's Valentine's Day. I'm home. We're going to be hitting the streets going out. So you're going to kind of watch me cook. Um, so with that said, let's get going. Bye. Okay, everyone, we're going to get started, and I am going to be preparing some eggs. And I actually just blended my eggs in a little bullet right here. And cooking right here is some breakfast sausage with a little bit of onion on it. So, what we're going to do is just add it right in here to it. There we go. And just move it around a bit and let the eggs cook. And these are going to cook pretty fast. So. Yep. Almost done. Already. So, here are the eggs and the breakfast sausage. Oops, don't want to lose an egg. And we're going to concentrate on the next meal, which I'm thinking is going to be um, I have some peppers and I got some leftovers. So, I'm going to take leftovers with me. I'm taking this little dish right here with me. And Rock and roll from there. Be right back. Okay, I'm gonna keep this rolling. We have right here some peppers. Nicely cleaned. Right here is some shredded cheese and I am using Cabot cheese. Um, what is this? A seriously sharp Vermont cheddar. And this is lactose free. I have some leftover chicken strips and I'm going to try to make them work. I'm going to cut them up um, really fine and put them in the peppers along with some cheese and then wrap it with the bacon. And we're just going to fry it up. Um, normally I will put it in the oven. I don't have time for the oven. And thank goodness these are old enough where they're nice and flexible and they're, they won't be... Um, way too crunchy or just too um, soggy. So it's gonna work out really well. So let me get to going with that and I will be right back. Okay, they're all wrapped up nice and cute. Here they are. Now we're gonna get them in the pan and get them fried up. Okay, we're gonna get started putting the um, little jalapenos, I'm sorry about the lighting, um, in our pan. Okay, and we're going to let these, oh, I'm so sorry about this, oh, this is awful lighting, sorry. Let me see if I can fix this a little bit. There. So we're going to let this cook on both sides, on all the sides, at least for like a minute and a half, and then check them and see if we're done this, and we'll be like that. And here they are, the jalapenos. They turned out ever so yummy. So what I'm going to do is finish pulling my stuff together. I have to pack a bag. And the next time you see me, um, we will be at our hotel. So I will check in a little bit later. 
the heck did I just do? Um, well, hello everyone, and I hope you're having a wonderful Valentine's Day. So, as you saw, I'm here at the hotel. I've done some gambling, and I haven't had anything to eat. Well, I'm not going to say that I had very little to eat today, which is not a good thing. So, I'm going to, I hope you can see this, have some ribs and one of the bacon wrap um, peppers and see where that puts me for today as far as if it's going to fill me up. I know I'm not going to be able to get in all my calories and that's fine. So I am going to eat this and I will be back with you guys. Okay, I finished the majority of my meal, but I also baked a strawberry cake. There's actual strawberries in here that I cut up. And I'm going to get this cut into, I don't know, it's pretty thick, so I'm going to say eighths, maybe, and have a slice of cake with you guys. So I'll be right back. Okay, here is the cake and what it looks like. Oh, that's bad lighting. Sorry. There. And I hope you guys are having or have had a wonderful um, Valentine's Day. Comment below and let me know what you're we're doing for Valentine's Day. Um, I'm seriously debating if I want to go back downstairs and do a little bit more gambling or just stay put and get some rest and just be ready for tomorrow because I'm staying for um, two nights so let me know what you guys are doing and we're gonna taste this together oh my god it's really good really really good so I'm gonna finish eating this and I'll be back to wrap things up for Valentine's Day Okay, everyone, I am back, and I'm going to wrap up Friday. It's been a really good day, and I hope you guys had a good day. So I'm going to be continuing this on tomorrow, and here, hopefully get it posted tomorrow. I will see you guys on Saturday. Happy Valentine's Day. Bye-bye. Good Saturday morning, everyone. Oh, my gosh. I am just getting up. Oh, I look a hot mess. Um, I'm going to try to pull myself together. I wanted to be up earlier to um, catch my good friend Keto Kitchen by Lisa's um, live, but it didn't happen. Um, I ended up getting up sometime after 7, and she probably went live like around 5 something my time. Oh, my God. Okay. When you see me next, I promise I will not be looking quite so crazy. Okay, <clears throat> you guys, sorry about my froggy voice. We are headed to the gym. So let's get it going. And hopefully um, it's light enough out where we can see outside and have a little bit of a view. Oh, it is. So let's go to the window really quick and look. Here is the view. And it's cold and wet out there. On a sunny day, this is a really nice walk. Look how pretty the decor is. And here is the workout room. Wow. 
we're going to try to do a little something before I get my coffee. So let's get to it. Alrighty, I am on the treadmill. And we're going to get this going. Okay, we're done with that little workout and we got our bulletproof coffee. We're going to head down to the slots for a little while and when I return, we'll do our first meal of the day. And I'm still thinking about what we're going to do for the dinner. Um, again, that four course meal looks pretty good. I mean, and that's not a bad price, 160 for two people. You know, you get the filet mignon and all that good stuff and the fish. But again, if that's all we're going to eat and not going to eat all the rest of the stuff, how good a price is it? Then they have a the little $80 one. So I'm still thinking about it. I don't know, but I love me a good filet mignon. And again, 160 I guess if you were eating everything, it's not a bad price. Um, and actually pretty damn good. So... I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Okay, I'll think about it. See you in a bit when I have the first meal. Okay, I am back and I'm just now sitting down to have my first meal of the day, which is my egg dish with a sausage. Let me see if you can see this. So, I'm going to eat this and I will be back with you guys. Okay, guys, this is my dinner. The steak is amazing. It's a ribeye. So we went for the ribeye, and it is amazing. I'll check with, back with you later. Well, hi, guys. I'm going to be wrapping up this video. It has been a very fun weekend starting from friday when we got to the hotel casino um just lots of fun um bands a lot of activities so and it's really really late and i don't think i'm gonna get this video up until sunday so um i want to thank you for following me on my journey no it wasn't a full day of uh for me food prepping so that's probably gonna happen um, when I get back home and more than likely I will video up some of that um, but I did bring some food with me to the hotel um, and we had a very keto friendly meal so just thank you guys so much I'm going to wrap it up I'm really tired and as always, thank you for following me on my journey. Don't forget to um, give this video a thumbs up and comment below. And I will be back actually to see you guys on Meaty Monday. Bye-bye.